Okay, so I want to do an example of the chain rule. This is the example that I had in the last video. So I'm going to take the derivative now. So I want to take the derivative. This is a composition of functions. So it's helpful if you, um, when you're getting used to doing this, it's helpful to write actually what the functions are. So in this, I'll use f of x is square root of x. And I'll use g of x is x squared plus 4. And now f of g of x is f of x squared plus 4, which is the square root of x squared plus 4. So now my goal is to take the derivative with respect to x of f of g of x. And now the chain rule says that this should be f prime of g of x times g prime of x. So I just need to figure out what these two things are. So notice that f prime of x, I can use the power rule, right? f of x is x to the 1 half. So this is uh, 1 half times x to the negative 1 half. So that's 1 over 2 root x. And uh, that means that f prime of g of x, which is uh, f prime of x squared plus 4, is now I, I do 1 over 2 and I take the square root of what's plugged in, right? So this is 1 over 2 square root x squared plus 4. And now g prime of x, this one's pretty easy. I, take, I use the, pro, the power rule. So this is uh, 2x plus 0. So this is 2x. And so now I know all of the terms in the product rule here, or in the chain rule here. So um, I'm going to uh, just plug them in, right? So the derivative of this thing is f prime of g of x times g prime of x, which is 1 over 2 square root x squared plus 4 times uh, 2x, times 2x. And so this is the derivative here. 